things they could board there. 225th Street and Broadway was just over the Harlem River Ship Canal between Manhattan and the Bronx. Technically, this part of the Bronx was in Manhattan since it was within the boundary lines of the original Spite and Dival Creek and Harlem River. But it's on the north side of the Ship Canal Bridge. The Ship Canal Bridge was the second one built there. The first one was moved down to uh, 207th Street and became the University Heights Bridge. This second bridge was added in 1907 when the IRT line was extended northward on an elevated structure along Broadway and the second bridge had the second level for the, ele uh, for the uh, IRT trains. Around 1960, this bridge was itself replaced by the present lift bridge, which also has two levels. As with most IRT lines, the middle track was used for off-hour layups of trains not used during the daytime or at night, but just for rush hours. Here's a train of the high voltage cars with standard bodies. They could readily be distinguished from the side because the side doors had three panels below the windows instead of the large single panel which characterized the low voltage control cars and some of the high voltage trailers. There's a deck roof car on the south end of this northbound train. You will find deck roof cars and unmodified Gibbs cars only on the ends of the train since they had the manual door controls. Here's a northbound train coming over the Broadway Bridge as it was then. The Marble Hill Station of the New York Central Railroad is immediately the train passing the, the uh, yard lead tracks and heading up into the 242nd Street Van Cortland Park Terminal. There was a period when the Diamond Jubilee train would operate regularly on this line on weekends and would be met by the Transit Authority's Transit Information Bus, which was a 1938 Fifth Avenue Coach Company Yellow Coach Double Decker, number 2124, which would meet the train at Van Cortland Park so that passengers could ride the train one way and the bus the other way, if they so chose. There's the Transit Information Bus, former Fifth Avenue Coach Company, 2124, right down below the Van Cortland Park terminal of the Broadway line. This was the Nostalgia Special in the 1979-1980 period as far as the IRT train was concerned. Ride an old-time train northbound and, if you choose, ride an old-time double-decker bus southbound. This went on for several weekends. Uh, at another weekend here is the Diamond Jubilee train approaching and stopping at the 242nd Street Terminal as seen from the south end looking north and here's the same train having uh, made its uh, station stop and changed ends now heading south out of 242nd Street Van Cortland Park Terminal for another run down the Broadway IRT subway.